The Indian spacecraft is on the moon. India Space Agency locates the Vikram lander on the moon surface day after the failed touchdown. You can imagine how happy they are. Uh, now, this is the latest news today on Sputnik News. Friday night, the Indian Space Research Organization, ISRO, ISRO, lost contact with the Vikram lander. That was during the last stage of the moon landing operation. It was just minutes before it was supposed to land near the moon's south pole. The Indian Space Research Organization, ISRO, ISRO, stated that it has found the location of the Vikram lander on the moon's surface a day after losing contact with the module. This is according to ISRO chief K. Sivan, and this is what he announced today in his tweet. We found a Vikram on the surface of moon, and I am sure we connect soon with Vikram lander and successfully complete our Chandrayaan-2 mission. That's amazing. I'm so happy for them. Now, according to K. Sivan, the orbiter has clicked a thermal image of the Vikram lander. The orb orbiter got a thermal image of the Vikram lander. The ISRO chairman stress, quoted by Live Mint, it must have been a hard landing. We do not know if the Vikram module was damaged during the landing on the lunar surface, but it is on the lunar surface. The Vikram landing module which was part of the Chandrayaan-2 Chandrayaan automatic station, was supposed to deliver a 12 kilogram or 27 pound Pragyan lunar rover to the moon's surface. That's pretty light. I mean, uh, 27 pounds is nothing. The device was supposed to explore the area around the moon's south pole. In the meantime, the main spaceship, the orbiter, will remain in lunar orbit for at least a year. So that's there at least. That's wonderful for them. So they must be flying high from their glee at this news. The mission was particularly important for the country because if successful, it would be the first Indian object to make a soft landing on the moon, as well as the first device in the world to, set, to land on the south pole of the moon. So more on this. Uh, who knows? We'll see what uh, they come up with. Will it be working? Will we get more images of the South Pole? We'll see. That's great news. Great news. Now, it could be that it had more than a soft landing. Perhaps it was so hard that something was jostled out of place. And uh, we'll see if it's be, it'll be able to work or not. In the meantime, their orbiter will be orbiting for the next year. So I'm sure they're very happy about this. Wonderful news. I'll leave links below on Sputnik News. If you'd like to join me on my Patreon account, you will hear content not covered by mainstream media. These riveting stories will be based on my research and I will state my opinions and give my personal insight on diverse and controversial subjects and world events, events not covered by mainstream media and not certainly on not supported by YouTube guidelines. So whatever I have on my Patreon, most of those will not be on my YouTube channel. Please consider becoming a member today. More of the, the most significant and important videos will be on my Patreon channel. Your support helps me to continue my research and keeps this YouTube channel alive. And we depend on your support, your generous charity, because we help economically challenged families here in Athens, Greece in Kapota, and we also help the young generation with university tuition and the community around our church. Thank you.